regarding non-identifying, nothing is going to change at all. The only thing that will change is that you no longer identify, that you no longer have um, a goal with what you're doing. So for example, Martin, you're at the gym right now. If you are at the gym, I could see you. If you're at the gym and you're at the gym and you're exercising because you enjoy it. So there's not the goal with, I'm doing this because I want to do something. Because if you do that, then there's an identifying. And I know that you probably have, it looks like you've got leg day today. So if you have leg day, then you might have a lot of expectations to how your leg day is gonna go. You might wake up this morning and think, oh, it's leg day. I think, yeah, it's leg day. With that, you have identifying. And, and the identifying is when we're no longer free because you need to be in a place where, where you're free to choose. So when you get to the gym, the gym might be closed. Then you're fine with the gym being closed and you just go for a run instead or um, do some squats out in the parking lot. But the identifying is what is tying us into something being in a certain way and us being immensely dependent on it being in a certain way. So we're, it, we're back to the ego. We're back to the ego wanting to, to dictate, to have certain expectations to what life is. And when life is just being life and it doesn't happen the way that ego has planned it, then ego gets disappointed with life. But because the ego is very much, um, we are identifying very much with, with our ego, we believe that we are disappointed. I am disappointed. It's not the way that I want it to be. I would like things to be different. So this one is very important to remember when we talk about non-identifying, that nothing will change. You just won't identify any longer. The identifying is gonna let go and there's just being instead. So whatever is happening is completely fine. Whatever is not happening, it's completely fine because you just are. And that is, that is, the, that is the, um, the freedom in, in actually just being.